morning TK. On Wednesdays for Gross Motor, we do yoga. And I would like to introduce you to this book called Morning Yoga by Miriam Gates and illustrated by Sarah Jane Hinder. Okay, because today's the first yoga lesson, Miss Fu's going to follow this book and introduce you to some of the poses. And then as you get to know the poses better in a couple of weeks, there's a website called Cosmic Yoga for Kids. And she is so wonderful. After a couple of weeks, we'll move you on to that website and she will tell you stories while you do your yoga. It's so wonderful. So are you ready? Get into something comfortable. And if you have a mat, bring your mat down to the floor. And if you don't have a mat, it's okay. You don't need it. You ready? My first breath is long and deep. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, my arms reach out to the sides, lift up to the sky, and then relax back down. So let's practice that three times. Okay, here we go. Just go ahead and have a nice stand, nice and tall. Your feet and your legs are together. And go ahead and take a nice deep breath in. Reach to the sky and float it back down. One more. I feel so calm already with just three breaths. to shake off sleep. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I twist my whole body from side to side, swing my arms back and forth. So go ahead and give yourself a straddle, just a little straddle, open up your legs for a little straddle and take your arm and let's swing back and forth. And if you want, you can even Fist up your hand, and when you swing back, you can give yourself a little massage here on the back. Okay? Not too hard. There you go. Make sure you're breathing in and out. How about five more, six more times? Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. How about ten? Seven, eight, nine. Good job. Today, I'm a fiery volcano reaching high. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I lift up on my tiptoes and reach my fingers high. Okay. Let's be a volcano. Are you ready? Go ahead and stand. And if you need to, if putting your feet together causes you to feel a little in unbalanced, it's all right if you give you if you give yourself a little bit of a straddle. Um, okay. So we're gonna breathe in. Lift our Lift our arms up real high and see if you, we can use our muscles right here to lift us up on our tippy toes. Here we go. In tippy toes and breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more time. Breathe in on our tippy toes. Breathe out. Good job. A brave ski jumper ready to fly. 
As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I bend my knees and sweep my arms back. Okay, so I'm gonna stand to the side. My legs are together. I'm gonna breathe in, bend my knees, and I'm going to breathe out. And you can straighten your neck right here. There we go. Okay, stand back up. Breathe in, bend your knees, breathe out and down, deep, up. One more time, breathe in, bend. And let's see if we can stay here for a count of 10, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, flashing across the sky. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, with my knees bent, I glide my hands up high. Ready? Go. Once again, feet together if you want. If you feel balanced, if not, you can separate it a little. But breathe in, bend, and sit back down. Ready? And arms up high. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. One more time. Breathe in. Breathe out. This time, we're going to make lightning bolts, okay? Breathe out. All right. Today, I'm a mountain, quiet and still. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I press down through my feet and stretch my spine. This part right here is your spine, okay? It goes from your lower back all the way up to your neck. I stretch my spine so it is long. I roll my shoulders back and press my palms together just like a solid mountain. So put your legs together. Think about your spine, stretch it up high, breathe in, roll your shoulders back, put your palms together. We're going to stay here for nice 10 breaths, okay? And if you want to give the back of your neck a stretch, go ahead and chin to chest. Not so much, just a little so you can feel the tension. So you can feel that stretch in the back of your neck. Last breath. Make it the deepest breaths you've taken today. Ready? Breathe in. And breathe out. A gentle stream flowing downhill. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I round my back, bend my knees, and roll down to the ground. Breathe in, 
Spread it out, bend your knees, and just let your body roll. If you want, you can even bend it so that your stomach and your chest right here is right up against your thigh. And just let everything kind of dangle down. If you want, you can even spider finger to one side. Take a nice deep breath in and out. Take a nice deep breath in. On your out breath, go back to center. Breathe in to the other side. And on your out breath, back to center. And slowly roll up. Slowly, slowly. And round your shoulders. And back to mountain pose. dog stretching with skill as I breathe in as I breathe out I press my palms and feet into the earth raise my hips up to the sky okay so we'll start out with being on all fours first okay so go ahead and come on down like this tabletop position and once you press both open up your fingers wide okay and don't place them too far just right underneath your shoulder and then when you take a nice deep breath in you're going to push your knees off the mat and onto your feet ready there just like that. Take a couple of nice breaths here. And if you want, you can step it out like this. And we can do a three-legged dog, okay? Have the, so put your, plant your left foot all the way down and raise your right leg and bark like a dog. Us, 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 us. And go ahead and put it down. And the other side, plant your right leg down. Lift up your left leg and bark like a dog. Us, 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 us. Nice job. Now go ahead and get yourself back to all fours. And push yourself up to a standing position. There you go. Today, I'm an explorer, calm and awake, as I breathe in, as I breathe out. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, on hands and knees, I bring my left hand forward, lift my right leg back and balance. Then I switch sides. Okay, so we're gonna get back on all fours, our tabletop position. Okay, you're gonna press down firmly on your hands and your legs. Okay. Then we're going to, our right hand is going to shoot straight up and then our left leg, our posing, are going to stick back out and you can flex it just like that. And let's count to three. One, two, three. Bring them both back down. Good job. And now we're going to do the other side. So go ahead and plant your palm your left palm firmly down, spread your hands, okay? Lift up your right hand, point it straight in front of you, and now your right leg. 
straight to the back. And go ahead and just look straight down. Okay, now take a nice deep breath in and out. And make sure you're breathing now. I'll count for you. One, two, three. Bring it back together and down. Nice job being a pirate looking for treasures. Bridges on the paths I take as I breathe in, as I breathe out. I roll onto my back and press my feet into the earth. Using my forearms for support, I lift my hips up high. All right. So now we're going to go down on our backs. Okay. Go ahead and just lower yourself down easily sometimes this is how miss boo likes to do it i like to just kind of roll my back a couple of times ah uh, can you do this good and then on my last time i'm just gonna lay down okay go ahead and lift your knees up high you're gonna take your hands and place it right next to your bum Okay, we're going to lift, use our core muscles here to lift our hips up. Ready? And lift up. Good job. And take a couple of breaths here. How about one more? Bring it down with the out breath. Good. Let's do it one more time. Ready? Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and lower it on the out breath. This time we're going to breathe in and lift up and breathe out and drop it back down. Okay, we'll do that three times. Ready? boats on the journeys I make. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I sit up tall to lift my legs and arms off the ground with my knees straight or bent. So now let's get into our boat pose. So go ahead and start by sitting nicely like this, okay? And if you need to, go ahead and take your hands and put it behind you for some support. Lean back on that hand, then lift up your leg. And if you want, you can lift it straight. But since we're just beginning, go ahead and bend it. And now, take your arms and put it parallel or beside your leg. There you go. And go ahead and let's breathe. Good job. Want to try that once more? Yes? Okay, ready? Breathe in. Thank you.
ready for the day. As I breathe in, as I breathe out, I sit with my legs crossed, my spine grows tall, my shoulders roll back, and I rest my hands on my knees. Just like our friends right here, they are all in lotus pose. Okay, so go ahead and crisscross. Take your hands, put it on your knees, and you can look down, you know, right where the bridge of your nose is. If you like, if you feel comfortable, go ahead and close your eyes. We're gonna take nice 10 breaths in this nice, calm position, okay? You to relax the muscles on your face. Your cheeks, your chin, let it relax. Take a nice deep breath in. Expel it through your mouth. Make sure those shoulders are rolled back and relaxed, but you're sitting straight up. Your spine is still nice and tall. Feel the heaviness, the gravity on the tips of your fingers. <sighs> Relax your thighs. Mm, all the way down your legs. <sighs> and your toes. And you feel so light, like a feather. Also so grounded like a rock. And so peaceful inside. Eyelashes open. Take a nice deep breath in and exhale it really nicely out through the mouth, okay? <sighs> I wish you a happy day. Namaste.